Lophodermium needle cast of scotch and red pine is one of the most interesting of the needle cast diseases because chemical management, fungicide application, is generally done not in the spring when almost all other needle cast diseases are managed, but actually in late summer. Uh, that's because the spores of the needle cast pathogen or fungus don't spread until they act the needles actually leave the tree. So once the needles are cast or fall, the fruiting bodies of the fungus are still closed. And then in July, August, September when it's moist and humid, those fruiting bodies open and the spores release. So in order for the chemical to effectively manage the spore release, you have to put the chemical on uh, in late summer when those spores are being released. So again, you'll see your primary symptoms in spring, the needles will cast. But they lay in the tree quite frequently right within the branches or they fall to the base of the tree. Then later in summer, as moisture through humidity or rain increases, those fruiting bodies will release their spores and infect the tree. And they will spread for many, uh, for many feet, infecting other trees on strong winds. So it's not just that tree, it's other trees that will be infected. Again, those trees will become infected. Uh, that fungus will live in those needles for more than a year. When those needles fall off, again, the spores will spread. So good management, a lophodermium uh, needle cast disease is a little different than the other needle cast diseases in that your application has to go on in late summer and not in uh, mid-spring.